I'm about to head to bed and I'm so exhausted after a long day of work. I'm about to head to bed and I'm so exhausted. I'm about to head to bed. I'm about to head to bed and I'm so exhausted after a long day of study at school. I even go to the gym around 6 p.m. Done, done all my school homework, my self improvement, all that stuff, and then I take my time, actually spend some of my time to actually record this video. But before I head, head to bed, I just kept on have, thinking that nowadays a lot of people are having sleep problems, sleep disorder, amnesia, being anxiety about sleeping. So I just want to make a quick video about it. The reason why you can't sleep is not because you think that you haven't tired your mind, your physique enough. In your mind, just keep on thinking that haven't I already tired my body through gym? Keep on intense workout. Haven't I keep on tiring my mind? But keep on challenging myself doing those things that are actually mentally challenging. That is the reason. You having that thought is the reason why you can't sleep. You think too much. You are overthinking. And this causes you can't sleep properly at all. Have you ever realized that once you overthink something, you can't perform any better at all? When you go hit the gym, when you go actually go competition, if you're overthinking about it, you'll perform way worse than you are if you just clear your mind and just don't just focus on the present moment. It's the exact same with your sleeping. After you cover your shit, after you covering your bed, you close all your lights and just kept on thinking that, oh shit, tomorrow I have homework to do. What gonna do, what I'm gonna do for tomorrow, what tomorrow's gonna happen, is it exciting or not? You having those kind of thought and especially those kind of thought that excites you is the reason why you cannot sleep. But nowadays you keep on scrolling through your phone before you sleep, social media, Instagram, those kind of things, info just keep on hits your dopamine level. This causes you that you can't sleep. So you, we need to find a way to actually prevent this thing to happen to stop you from overthinking it so the best way to do it is my way which is firstly stretching plus to have the thought of you are not gonna think any other thing other than resting and relaxing when you lay on bed so we're gonna cover it one by one the first thing is stretching it's so underrated. I don't understand why nowadays people just neglect stretching. If you are an athlete, if you are a person who likes sports, trust me on this, you must stretch every single day. At least for 15 minutes, bro. At least just try to stretch for 15 minutes a day. And when you start doing it, doesn't matter you're doing full body, upper body, or lower body. I do lower body because my leg is quite stiff. Trust me on this. Once you start doing stretching, then you realize how stiff you are. It'll cause you a lot of injuries. The reason why NBA players, those sport athletes, tearing their ACLs, Achilles, knee pain, is because they don't stretch enough. They have, they are just withstanding too much pressure on the court. Your legs, they can't relax. You need to relax that muscle, especially your thigh. It's a part that most people think they are strong at, but in fact, they are not. So you must stretch every single day. Any YouTube videos you can find, no matter it is, just keep on doing every single day consistently. Then you realize that your body just feel more lighter. You feel more agile. Your movement will be more better compared to you before stretching. And not only you improve your athletic performance, you make you sleep better. You improve your quality of sleep because your muscle is tired. You relax your muscle. And the second thing is quite hard to do is to exactly think that you won't do anything. You won't think about business, study, relationship, social media, not, no, none of that. You're just going to think about how you're going to rest, sleep. You're just going to think about relaxing. Once you lay on that bed, once you cover yourself in bed sheets, you're not going to think anything anymore. Force yourself to think like that. Imagine you yourself at the beach. Imagine you yourself in the middle of the sea, in the middle of the ocean. This kind of thought is going to make you feel more relaxed and actually sleep better. I actually use this method every single time if you can't sleep. And I know that feeling, you try to sleep, you try to improve your sleep, but after two hours you can't sleep at all. You feel angry at yourself. Sometimes I will even wake up and keep on blaming myself. I was even going to cry because I cannot sleep. And my parents keep on complaining, why do you cry? Stop crying. It's your fault that you cannot sleep. 
I know that feeling is so frustrated you cannot sleep. Because you know that tomorrow you're gonna be shit if you don't have a good sleep right now. So these two ways, stretching and having the constant thought of you're not gonna think anything anymore, these two things is gonna help you significantly on your sleep quality. Just try this for about two weeks and tell me your results. If you have to watch if you're interested, you always remember when Pacific goes to my time. Because I'm fast and